Hi everybody. So today I want to do a question and answer today. Okay. You guys, I'm having a complex. <laughs> do you ever just feel like you're ugly? <laughs> like you just have those ugly days, like doing these, the cameras and all the stuff when I'm looking at myself, I just, it's like never the right angle or the right lighting or something. I just, you know, I feel very self-conscious. Like I always had the nice body, rock on the body, and could talk about that all day long and felt very confident in my physique. But I think it was honestly to get over like my face. <laughs> honestly. Yeah. I've always like I know I have really nice skin and pretty eyes, but I don't feel pretty. I've never felt pretty. I always used to watch that show, like, remember that show, The Swan on Fox? <laughs> I always said, oh, I want that to be me. I just want to go in and fall asleep, leave the eyeballs in my skin, and just change it up. <laughs> Make me beautiful. Anyway, that's how I'm feeling today. But um, that being said, I have some questions and some questions about fitness for you. Um, the first one is Whitney Fan says, have you ever thought of being a personal trainer? Um, yes, I have. Um, yeah, I, I used to be an aerobics instructor and um, I actually love training people and um, given the right environment, yeah, I think I would enjoy it. Um, that's how the whole thing started. I started with the trainer, Jerry Blaze on blazebodies.weebly.com and he was started it all and that was because of a personal trainer and I'm into it. Anything fitness I love. Um, th she also asks, what made you go to TNA after being out of the ring for 10 years? Good question. Um, I went to TNA for one reason, one reason only and that reason is because Vince Russo called me and Vince Russo was probably the only one that I trust in that business and that I really like in that business. I really like and respect Vince Russo a lot. I think he changed changed wrestling. And I knew I was in good hands if he was, you know, writing or doing something to bring me back. Now, business wise it didn't work out so well for me, but um I'm happy to have gone back and been with Vince Rus Russo and, and to have said hello to all the fans. Um, she says, are you teaching English to high school students? No, I'm not teaching English to high school students. As a matter of fact, all of my students are either senior citizens or young children. <laughs> um, PP Famous says, do you miss a lot of people in the U.S.? Do you have a lot of friends in Japan or do you mostly keep to yourself? So, um... Do I miss a lot of people in the U.S.? No, not really. Um, I miss my best friend, Christian Meralde. I miss him so much. Um, I miss my friend, Hiroko. And, um, no, I don't really miss any any friends because I still take, I'm, sometimes I stay, I miss my cousin, Joy Joy, you know, but I stay in touch with them probably more. Well, not Christian, but um, I really miss him most of all. But do I have a lot of friends in Japan? Yes, I have a lot of friends in Japan. Although most of them are American, and I like that um, because I can't speak Japanese, so it's very hard for me to communicate, um, make new friends. But most of my friends have families and kids, and so, you know, they live their life and do their thing. So I see them, you know, every Sunday or maybe once a week, you know, a different person. And um, then the most of the rest of the week I teach and hang out with, with Horn, and um, I la enjoy my me time. So it's perfect. I Anybody that knows me, like, any boyfriends that I have or um, had or, you know, like best friends. I could spend 24-7 attached to the hip with that person. That's just the way I am. So 
I'm a very clingy person. I like to have fun with them and be friends with them and all the rest of that good stuff. Um, okay, Jonathan, Jonathan Jenkins says, um, I eat a lot of protein and carbs. I mostly eggs, milk, turkey, wheat, and granola. I work out with you every day. I use the 20 pound, 10, 20, and 30 pound dumbbells. What do you use? I'm vegan, but how can I get bigger? Don't want to be the rock size, just Miramar Idol China. Okay, so um, I think it's awesome that you're doing that work. That workout, more than meets the eye, I was so excited to do that. I just wanted to do my own workout video one day. And that was a tough workout, I know, but that's how I worked out every single day. Yeah, hard like that. That was like, I think I, I had to do that for three days straight, I think, to do that, to do that video. It was insane. And you know who really loved it was the, the Army guys, you know, go to all the Army bases, and they loved it. And I love that. They loved it. Um, what can you do to get bigger? Uh, get enough calories and lift heavy. Lift heavy, lift hard, go to failure, and keep at it. Real muscle, and when you earn it, you keep it, but it takes time. So be patient and just try your hardest. Of course, you know, i not recommending the eggs, the milk, the turkey, or, you know, the meat products anymore. I think that you can have a beautiful body, you know, without that, and um, you can find your protein other places, other ways. Brad Don V says, when moving to Japan, did you ever think about possibly joining wrestling there? Or is wrestling officially over for you? Well, um, that's a good question. So when I first came to Japan, it was uh, because I was wrestling for Antonio Inoki, who is very famous here. And he pretty much um, owns the wrestling industry here. And Pride was happening and K1 was hot. Um, but that was over 10 years ago, and now wrestling's not so hot, so. And also because I wrestled Masio Otono and the guys, it was kind of like a one-shot deal here, and not so much of an entertainment thing that I could do every week. Um, Marissa Mattia says, I'd like to know, I'd like to, to, um, I'd like to know the direction to take for weight loss. Counting calories, watching carbs, what do you recommend? Mm. I'm experimenting right now. I'm trying to just um, not so much watch my calories, although I'm like not going to eat like 6,000 calories today, you know. like um, I feel like I should be around the 1,500 mark, but I'm going about 2,000 almost every day. But I know that I'm eating really good, healthy stuff. And so I can feel it in my body, and my shape is really good, and I feel really great. So I'm not going to bash myself with the calorie restriction or feeling unsatisfied. But um, I would rec definitely, definitely recommend a plant-based diet for sure. No ifs, ands, or buts, and some type of exercise. There's just no way around it, and why would there be? Because it feels so great. Okay, Kelly Denise Elder says, um, in between smoothies, do you eat anything or do you just have two smoothies and dinner? I am a snacker. <laughs> I used to be. I love snackity snacks, schmickety schmacks, and I used to eat a lot of snacks. But um, now that when I'm really paying attention to it and I'm drinking a lot of water and I'm having these big smoothies and these bigger meals full of vegetables and they fill me up, I don't find that I am snacking as much. <laughs> okay, you know, well, a little bit, but no, no normally I'm not sm snacking anymore. Um, she says, I'm a fat kid and I want to lose weight. I know diet alone isn't enough. What are the best exercises for a beginner that's pushing 40? What do you like to do? Um, for me, I love working out in the gym. Um, I love 
not a good, great swimmer, but I love jumping around in the water. I love um, yoga because it makes me feel so good afterwards. And I've seen the benefits, but I really had to make myself do it for many years. Um, whatever form of exercise you can do that gets you into, whether it's the music or it's dance or it's a class or something, find anything, walking, putting your iTunes on, doesn't matter. Just find something to do and do it. Dedicate yourself to 20 minutes, 20 minutes. Okay, um... Uh, Mitchka, 1001, Josh says, have you ever tried Vegemite? <laughs> yes, I tried Vegemite. And I thought this was an interesting question because people always ask you what foods do you like, but people don't usually ask you what foods do you absolutely not like. I do not like Vegemite. I think it's, like, horrible. Um, I don't like natto here in Japan. It makes me made me literally gag, and I do not like rye seeds at all. They're like, I, 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 I can't take them. All right, so I'm going to cut this short. Um, i already gone too long, and I'll do a part two with questions and answers. Okay, see you soon. Peace.